Hey guys, welcome into another episode in the deep playthrough. Artyom, incoming to two of them. I'll give you some cover from above. Of Metro Exodus. Stealth section. It's actually pretty hard. Save the game. No. <coughs> this is where I went wrong in the previous episodes. We need to get, I think, over there. Not even sure where we need to get to. But this guy noticed me. Alright. So I maybe I can check from his flashlight where he's looking. God damn it. It's on. Cover it. Man, this is pretty hard. Um All right, one more time. No other option. Don't turn your flashlight on either. They could notice. All right, pretty boring section, but and probably boring to watch. Repetition, but yeah, cannot really help it. So there are two guys over there. I need to stay out of the... Ah! Now I understand. There's... Um, there's a copper... There's electricity over here. This will help. can just shoot them probably so I just shoot them here we go hey who's that I see the enemy god damn it how could he see me I was in the dark anyways I know how to get through this section that's a good thing um, 
Progress is small steps. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Atyom, incoming, two of them. I'll give you some cover from above. Bit annoying. This waiting before you you can retry. Right, this should work. Going to his buddy. Not sure what he's doing. Ah, check it out. Totally missed that the first time around. What are you doing down there? All right, will they go into alert mode? There he is. That's another one down. I actually wanted to take them down silently or uh, non-lethally. I usually only kill when I'm being attacked. So let's just do that again. I, I, would, I want to do this non-lethally. <laughs> it's pretty simple. Don't turn your flashlight on either. They if you know the way. thing is this waiting game. Let's see if I can do it quicker. Take it. Um, systematically. I'll give you some cover from above. Slow is accurate, accurate is fast. Or however that saying goes. Slow is steady, steady is fast. Oh, 
Oh, I for, again forgot to pick up those oxygen filters at the start. Somehow, if you shoot them, they will just go into high alert. What are you doing down there? Alright, I really have to be careful because... They have eagle eye vision. Ah, shit, that was my chance. Can I still make it? Oh, yeah, there's another dude over there. They're in each other line of sight. Alright, I wait one more round till he does his patrol. Because the guy at the back they're in each other's line of sights. I can easily take him out, I think. Lethally or, or with the pistol, but it would be pretty cool to do this Sam Fisher style. guy getting away from the pack ah they immediately spot me it's on covering you all right this is uh, i wonder whether this is doable on the other hand i don't need to kill them i just need to go besides them that's probably the best way just sneak past that will be the next tactic. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Artyom, incoming, two of them. I'll give you some cover from above. If I don't leave, I wonder whether I can, by the way, drag bodies. Should try that, by the way. Let's try that. That would be another option. Just take him down and hide his body. Let's see if that works. Oh, 
Um, yeah, what button would that be? I don't think it's possible. In previous Metro game, I think it was possible. I'm just pressing some buttons over here. Not really doing much. All right, let's just go with the sneaky methods. guys over there. There's a guy over there. Man, this is pretty hard. It's a pretty big light over there. Yeah, God damn it. God damn it. Um, but I did see a door, I think, where I need to go. Maybe just shoot out that, that big light. Alright, it's all pretty fun, but this waiting at the start is super annoying. I just have to discard this episode. I'm really failing too much, but I'm not sure whether there is something in this episode at the start, which is not this section, like the um, the cutscene. If that is in there, in here, then I need to keep this episode in the playthrough. Maybe use. Um, Holy oh, shit. He almost spotted me. I could, of course, use a decoy. The command center came under enemy attack. The attackers are assumed to still be on the base territory. Also, this is a six. All unauthorized persons are to be fired upon immediately. Civilian personnel movement is prohibited until further notice. Attention! The jamming system is coming back online. 
Well done. You're almost at the hangar. Smooth sailing from here. Holy shit. Is it actually working? Woohoo! Nice! I was not expecting that to work. <laughs> hey. Actually, secret way in as well. So there was probably a much easier way. Alright, so I could have gone round, I guess. Let's just quickly see where this goes. And if I didn't miss any collectibles or anything. OCD is a bitch. Holy shit, there are a lot of guys over here. I know you're here, pal! And that means you're shit out of luck, eh? Alright, I was spotted. God damn it. Please don't start at the beginning. Yeah, nice. That was checkpoint. All right, you let's just. Now we have to find your back. All right, can I also take that weapon? Yes, with the other one. And so reflex sights. Up books. I wonder how many I missed. Diary. God damn it. So I missed a lot of them, I guess. Not collected, not collected. A lot. Both. Um, crumpled letter. Seriosa, we made it. You can drive almost to Roman Skoy just. Stay away from the highway, it's all blocked with scrap. From there you'd have to walk, of course, at least across the ring road. This place is alive, all right? The guys they have in their army are healthy as bulls. They're taking us to a filtration camp, but I don't think they'll keep us there long. A couple of days top, then they'll find some work for us. I already heard the guards talking of being short on, short on hands. I say you guys drop everything and come over here. I'll get everything ready. I'll send this letter as soon as I can, dead. Official note, outgoing number 253 11 2 top secret to Lieutenant Colonel Rylev, head of supply department. In reply to your request from March 23rd, I can report that the number of personnel at the external perimeters radio jamming station is as of uh, February 1st, 4,786 people, 3,857 of which number are special guard detail personnel to be supplied with extra means of individual protection. 723 are maintenance worker and 206 are command personnel. All right. Um, do we then get to that number? So that is one second. That is 45, 45, 80, 47, 86. Yes. Deputy head of special department major story. I was just adding up the two sub numbers to see, uh, or the three, uh, the categories to see if we would get to the total a uh, memo to all personnel of the shield project special guard detail in recent years there's been a notable noticeable increase in the number of attempts to breach our defenses by spies and enemy agents belonging to previously uncommon demographics women old people teenagers this serves to prove the utmost efficiency 
uh, of the special details defense effort, leaving the enemies no chance of ever achieving their goals of mapping our defense perimeter and carrying out sabotage by employing standard tactics. For that reason, all members of special guard detail personnel must carry out their duties responsibly and never falter in applying the special measures to any and all enemy agents detained. Remember, the enemy is resourceful and deceitful. The enemy is desperate enough as to throw the last resource into battle. Still, the enemy resources uh, are still vast and a cornered rat red is only more dangerous. Defense Council. Alright, I'm a little bit bummed out that I missed so many of uh, Moscow's um, I assume the, 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 the top one not marked as not collected those collectibles they were I assume being uh, above the this one uh, yeah being earlier in the game so that I actually missed them I missed five booklets which is a bummer because especially at the start of the game you want to get the the background story the context the exposition to get you uh, yeah well off so to say from the start uh, out uh, onwards um, but yeah it is what it is maybe offline I will just uh, go through uh, until here I mean uh, I'm not that far in the game and just read up and see if it was anything uh, interesting uh, in between episodes I may do that uh, postcards not collected not collected so postcards are collectibles and uh, yeah. diary I'm not really sure this is not a diary, this is a crumpled letter, this is a note, this is a memo. Not sure why this is all marked as diary instead of just random um, documents. But whatever. Uh, good to know there's a collectibles menu. Let's see if there are any hints. Quickly, um, as you encounter new gameplay elements, this section will be updated with more in-depth advice and playing meant for Exodus. Flashlight, flashlights, fight a piece of gear. It will light your way, help find valuables in the dark, and even scare away some of the mutants. Ah, this is a nice uh, tip. Just don't forget that you're much easier to notice when it's on lighter. You can use the lighter to find your way in the darkness and burn spider webs. Ah, another nice uh, tidbit. You can burn spider webs. You can use it even while shooting, though with a considerable drop in accuracy. Gas mask. Despite the years elapsed since the war, many places, especially on the surface where a gas mask is necessary for survival. Despite the years elapsed since the war, many places, uh, especially on the surface where a gas mask is necessary for survival. Yeah, it, I think it should be there are many places. Don't forget to put it on if you start suffocating. When you have the gas mask on your watch, displays time remaining before your current filter requires replacement. Always be on the lookout. For more filters and don't dawdle if you're running out of them. You can't survive for long just on the area of your lungs. It's okay to fix minor damage to the mask temporarily with some sticky tape, as long as you don't forget repairing it properly at the nearest station. Don't forget to take your mask gas, gas mask off once you clear the dangerous areas, otherwise you risk getting its visor shattered in combat. If your gas mask visor gets splashed with water, blood or dirt, wipe it with your hands. Okay, you can wipe it, but you can also fix it. One second, what was the fix button for the gas mask? Gas swap filter, gas mask holds. That's deep bed down. Sprint inventory, night vision, light metal bower. Wipe mask fix uh, gas mask. Ah, so it's the uh, holds the left shoulder button. Clear. Medkit. In a critical situation, a medkit could save your life. Don't forget to stock up on these. Throwing weapons. Besides the various long distance weapons, each Spartan's arsenal includes a set of throwing weapons, indispensable in some situations. Uh, so I'm a Spartan. Uh, the Artemis is a Spartan, apparently. A decoy will let you distract a guard standing in your way and slip by unnoticed or throw a chase of your tail. I should make more use of those. Knives are perfect for silently killing the mutants, mutants and taking down guards. They also let you save ammo since they can be used repeatedly. You can pick them up again, I think. 
Fragmentation grenades are great for dealing with groups of opponents, be they a hunting pack of mutants or a detachment of mercenaries suppressing you with fire. The important part to keep in mind is that if you don't want to hurt yourself, you should throw the grenades far enough. Yeah, that's uh, a good tip. Molotov cocktails are also, but also a pretty self-evident one. Molotov cocktails are also extremely useful in a pinch as they let you set almost any enemy on fire or put a wall of fire between yourself and the enemy should you be cornered. Alright, the light indicator. This indicator essentially shows how easy to see you are. If you're lit well enough for the enemies to notice you, the indicator on your watch lights up. Take a closer look at your watch to see it better. Alright, slowly but surely getting into the game. Mechanics. More and more. These are actually uh, train wheels, I think. They look like the wheels that were on the train. Man, I'm pumped. I'm not sure why. There are only a couple of collectibles, but I thought I was going through it quite thoroughly. Now it appears I've missed so many collectibles. Unless they are still uh, up for grabs further on in the level, but yeah, I'm not sure. Ah, I remember this part as well. This is also a pretty hard part, I think. Where is the old man? Artyom, try going down that ladder ahead. Just be careful. Is somebody got the air man? Yes, sir. The eagle is watching you. Captain, sir. If I may have permission to speak, this German is what she killed. What is he doing? He's going to set him off tomorrow. We'll find out. First, we handle the attack. There was a noise from behind. I'm telling you, there was a noise from behind the gate. There's nobody out there, that's for sure. It's the outside gate, so it could only be watchmen. What if it's the attackers? Well, then those watchmen just have a nice meal and we don't have to worry. <laughs> if you say so. Still, this is suspicious. You do your thing and I'll just stay here. Group A, report to your static. Holy shit. Group D, number two in the hangar. Holy shit. Group A. If your flashlight ever stopped working, don't forget you have a lighter. You could also find usable candles, lamps, and other stationary light sources in some areas. Go down with Seri and check the RV. So there really was no use getting down here, it seems. Cannot get any further here. Holy shit. and come out of your hiding spot! You're not getting away this time! <laughs> nice! You can actually take them out quickly. You can pick up your stuff.
Slowly but surely. Right, but it's pretty hard to get past that barrel of fire. So you think you can hide? Not for long. Not for long. And I don't really see. Uh, I think I need to get into that train. I assume. I don't see a way. You cannot crouch here. There's no ladder over here. Can I get on here? I cannot get up there. And they will for sure see me. Oh shit, there they are. On the train. Alright, I need to get rid of this alert face. Um, Come out or what I will probably do, right. because I will be failing quite a lot in this area as well, I expect. Um, I will just end the episode here, continue in the next one. And then in the next one, it will be the start of the next episode. Uh, I will only keep my uh, successful run. Yeah, so they do see me very easily. So then you don't have that uh, me endlessly dying. Ah. Nowadays, don't see me anymore. But I think that is a plan so that in the next episodes, you will only see my successful attempt through here. Instead of me messing it up all over and over. Um, so guys, I will end the episode, we'll continue in the next one, and uh, for the meantime, do not forget yourself, always do keep on gaming, see you later.